What is up, everybody? Welcome to the DPD Tech Express. I'm going to be showing you how to add your estimate delivery uh, of that specific product into your actual Shopify. So the very first thing you want to do is to have, let's say, an actual product into your actual Shopify. So as you can see, I have three products here. I'm going to hit into review on my online store just to make sure how it's going to be looking right. So as you can see, I have this store, the color, the size, the quantity, and product information. I wanted to see down here the estimate delivery uh, of the actual product. So in order to do that, there's actually two ways that we can do this. The very first and easy way to do it is to just go back into your actual Shopify dashboard, go into settings, and you can locate your applications and sales channel. This one should be bringing you into Shopify App Store. So here into Shopify App Store, you can just type the keyword of the element that you needed to add into your store, and it should be appearing almost any kind of application that can be helping you to do that. In this case, it's to open the estimate delivery date, and it's going to be showing you a lot of templates where you can get started with. For example, there's the ship insure, shipping insurance, delivery timer, the book you, estimate delivery date, and much more. What I want to do is to filter the one that are free to install, that has free plan available, and it has really great uh, reviews. As you can see, we have one that has more than 500 reviews. So if you find something that is a little bit much better, you can choose that. If not, you can just select the one that's uh, enabled there. In my case, I'm going to choose the one that says Stellar Delivery Data Backup or choose, let's say, for example, this one, Stellar Date uh, Status Plus. And now, as you can see, we do have the uh, Estimate Delivery Date Plus is disabled. So as you can see, this is how it's going to be looking my actual timer. Uh, what I wanted to do is to go free shipping to the country flag, the country name order within the next cut of time to display the data. So as you can see, we have the free boson. This is how it should be looking. Um, and then later on, I can just enable that into my products. So let's go into product. And here, as you can see, I'm going to hit into sync all my products. So sync all products successfully into my dashboard. I'm going to hit into enable. And the estimate delivery date plus is enabled. And when we have an order, it should be appearing the free shipping to order within the next order ready and order delivery. Here should be appearing to your actual status of how we can add this, uh, let's say, automatically. Now, what I'm going to be showing you is the manual way. To add this into the manual way, what I want to do is to go into my online store. And then what I want to do is to focus into customize. If you focused into your product section, in my case, it's my catalog. I'm going to hit here to my catalog. And as you can see, I have a bunch of products where I want to get started with. Let's say that I wanted to add, let's say, for example, this product. So down in here into this product, I wanted to check it out. How it's going to be looking, the delivery, estimate delivery and all of that. So into the left part, I have the template of the product information. I'm going to hit into add block. And here I'm going to hit into custom liquid. Into custom liquid, it's going to be popping up this new section where I needed to paste this code that I have created for you guys totally free. And I'm going to leave you that into the description. So once you add this snippet, I'm going to hit back. And this custom liquid, I'm going to move this down into the actual price. Whereas as you can see now, we have get it between. So I believe that maybe we can put this a little bit down into the buy buttons like that so here have the quantity add to card and get it between so now to edit this actual template of get it between i'm going to go back i'm going to choose my uh, custom liquid and here as you can see it says the get it between strong span uh, from date and to date and what it says from date and to date we wanted to edit the value of that so I'm going to go into to date. To date is Sunday. To date equal to to date Monday. So add days, let's say for example, six. Going to up and add days. I'm going to go, let's say for example, from eight to 15 days. There we go. And now let's hit into safe. Lastly, I'm going to hit now 
into the three dots and try to view the actual section of my product. I'm going to hit now into my catalog. I'm going to hit into this one. And as you can see, we have the overview, the art to the card, and here it should be appearing our actual uh, link of get it to. So get it between Wednesday, August 2nd and August the 9th. So as you can see, this is two options that are actually really, really simple. You can choose the best that suits for you, whatever you wanted to. So don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel if you wanted to see more great hoes of how we can add more stuff into your actual uh, Shopify products. Thank you so much for watching the video, guys. Hopefully, I can see you next time. And well, have lots of fun. See you soon.